Off the top at noon, we're tracking the tropics. We're keeping a very close eye on two disturbances, one which could become our next named storm. Good afternoon, I'm Francis Wang. And I'm Keith Jones. That disturbance heading in our general direction. Yeah, CBS4 meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez joining us now with what you need to know. Lisette. Yeah, there's still a lot of uncertainty and it's still too soon to say what impacts we could see here in South Florida, but certainly going to closely monitor this low pressure system, which is just east of the Lesser Antilles. As of this morning, the National Hurricane Center increasing the potential for this to become a tropical cyclone to a high chance of becoming depression even possibly as soon as later today or tonight and it is forecast to generally move west northwest across the lesser Antilles the Caribbean islands and eventually could be headed in our general direction the wave that's behind it that one just has a low potential of development that second disturbance is one that of course we'll also watch but as we look at the computer forecast models for the disturbance number one that's east of the lesser Antilles you'll notice that many of the models in agreement that it'll likely continue moving across the Lesser Antilles and then possibly across parts of Puerto Rico and Hispaniola and then of course what happens once it moves near or over some of these islands and the mountainous terrain and interacts with the land there's also the potential for wind shear and drier but for now some of the models are keeping it moving in our general direction or just to our south but really this is what we need to pay attention to look at all this deep tropical moisture regardless of development and whether it intensifies or weakens it looks like as we head into to late weekend into the weekend with all this moisture in place. If this plays out the way that we're seeing this computer forecast model predict, then we are in for some very wet conditions and the potential for flooding.